Guys, I found a new OP secret meta formation in eFootball 2024 mobile. And today, I'm gonna show you how you can build it and also how you can play with it. Make sure to watch this video till the end and learn all the secret tips and also learn how you can participate in 550 coins giveaway. Let's go. So, the formation is 4213 out wide team. This formation is super OP because why? I'm gonna tell you later. So, for the manager, I put de la fuente because i mean i can yeah why not but if you don't have him you can play any other out wide formation manager and be good with it okay so make sure your manager is out wide and let's start the team building for the goalkeeper i have emiliano martinez because why because he's offensive goalkeeper and he's one of the best free goalkeepers in the game and yeah he's good you want to use offensive goalkeepers for the right back, left back, two offensive fullbacks. My Albert Ferrer is offensive fullback. And my Hernandez, he's not offensive fullback, but he's a fullback finisher. I avoid using defensive fullbacks in your team with this formation. For the center backs, you want to use one build up and one destroyer for that perfect balance. For the CMF, so what I use personally for the CMF is I use one creative playmaker and the other one i use box to box i've tried many play styles but i came to the conclusion that box to box plus creative playmaker is the best and also you want to pair up with an attacking midfielder who has creative playmaker yes no whole player only creative playmaker it will make sense later okay so stick to me so for the right wing of course we have paid win the best crosser in e football 2024 mobile david beckham whose playing style is cross specialist you don't really see this play style that much and you might be like yo reviews i don't have freaking beckham and i don't have a cross specialist playing style player what should i do i'm gonna tell you you have two options first option is pay to win option second option is free to play so for the pay to win what you do is you join my discord server and then you dm me like yo reels i want to buy coins and i will sell you my coins and then the second option is to find someone who has cross specialist play style that can be a right winger personally i don't even know who has cross specialist play style except him but good luck also alternatively instead of back him you can go any other right winger but make sure they have the prolific winger playing style for the left winger i use bapi because i don't have a good left winger to play with like i don't have a prolific winger so i just use bapi like you know what he's not bad like he makes runs and that's the only thing i need for him and again if you have a cross specialist use cross specialist for your left wing or if you have roaming flank use roaming flank prolific winger is also good or you can just use advanced striker it doesn't really matter because with this team you want to have one winger that can cross and one winger that can make runs and dribble for the cf you want to go goal pusher advanced striker any of these two avoid having deep lying forwards or fox in the box i mean fox in the box can work but it's better if it's goal pusher or advanced striker and also make sure that they have good finishing good heading good speed good jumping and physical contact these are the most important stats your center forward needs to have so let me just quickly demonstrate to you how this formation is gonna work imagine if i have the ball with kevin de bruyne okay i threw past the ball to lampert and he's gonna be right here i'm gonna pass to bellingham and when the ball is in bellingham one of these two either albert ferrer or hernandez will make a run preferably Albert Ferrer because you have B David Beckham right here. So if he makes a run, you need to look at the mini map and see if he's unmarked. If he is, just throw past the ball to your right back to Albert Ferrer and he's gonna be right there. And with Albert Ferrer, what you wanna do is you wanna cut inside like this so your opponent's left back and center back will target Albert Ferrer. While he does that, your backhand will make a run just like this. He will be in the edge. You throw past the ball to backhand and he will have so much open space. You can easily cross the ball and let Holland just head it. Boom. So yeah, that's what you can do. I will show it further to you during our gameplays. Let's go. Wanna sell our account or maybe buy a new one with insane cards? Rewas Gang got you covered. Wanna buy coins? Rewas Gang got you covered. Do you just wanna chat about football and have a great time? 
Rewoods Gang got you covered. There is so much you can do in the Rewoods Gang, so come and join our community and get a chance to participate in giveaways and tournaments. Rewoods Gang, the best eFootball Discord server. And right now, I'm gonna test this formation against bro who purchased coins from me. Um, if you didn't know, if you purchase coins from me, you get the ability to 1v1, priority in replies, and the ability to participate in tournaments and giveaways, and you even get a roll, and yes, it's good. So, join my Discord and buy coins from me and get a chance to 1v1 me and participate in a video. So yeah, everyone is in a perfect condition. Let me see my bro's squad. Yeah, yeah, his squad. Yeah, you can see. Pretty good. So, let's start the attack. Bellingham, you run. When he comes, pass the ball. Alvarez, nowhere to run, so we just pass the ball to Albert Ferrer. Okay, look at the mid. There's Bellingham open. Get the ball, shield the ball, and okay, we still have the ball. That's good, that's good. Pass, pass, Albert Ferrer, crossing, and... <laughs> Bro, kick the ball. Bro, kick the ball, like, that's the thing, so, with this formation, you just run, see, can you pass? If yes, wait till the opponent comes, and then pass. If no, then just keep running, okay? If he's giving space, keep running, but if he's not giving space, then you can, like, turn around and do stuff. The most important thing is keeping the ball and passing to the right teammate, okay? So, we're playing Division 1 and I get an opponent from Division 3. Yeah, typical division, you know? So, my players! Okay, Holland's in good formation and Beckham is in good formation and also Alba Ferrer and AMF. Okay, you know what? This is pretty good. All the core players are in a good formation and... What the hell is this? Okay, you know what? I'm gonna cook that guy. So guys, you want to do attack one when you start the match because that's the most optimal thing for your team and Is this guy serious right now, bro? Is this guy serious right now, bro? Bro, be doing some possession game shit with me, bro. Bro's gonna get cooked. Bro's gonna get cooked. I'm gonna flame him now. Guys, I should- Guys! Guys! Don't make me mad, bro! Like, this kid be really doing some possession game shit against me, bro. Get- Yeah, I'm not gonna- I'm, Yeah, bro. I better not say that word, but get shit on, bro. Get shit on. Nah. Bro, really thought his nerd ass really thought he was some tiki taka shit, bro? He's not. He's not him. Oh, bro, he's cooked. Oh, bro, he's cooked, guys. Oh, bro, he's cooked. Oh, my God. Okay, guys, so why he's losing is because he has three center backs. Like, I've said to, to my subscribers... In one of my vids, that playing three center backs is a bad idea. Oh, shish! Shish! So, guys, I've told my subscribers many times that to not put three center backs in your team because it's just bad. Especially if you face teams that have right wings or left wings it's very bad to defense against them you will struggle a lot and yeah as you can see already two considered goals it could have been three if i didn't hit the post but yeah it's whatever i can score a lot of goals look at that bellingham he's not making that runs because he's like very necessary right now to me so yeah that's why playmaker is good boom maybe hit that shit no okay bro this guy likes to play too much loki but like who does he think I am, bro. I'm literally him. I am Revus. I am Revus himself. Oh, bro. He bro is cooked. Oh, bro is cooked. Oh, shit. Okay. Guys, if you are facing teams with three center backs, you want to attack from sides more. Do not attack from the center because... Oh, oh, own goal. Holy shit. Do not attack from the center because, like, their players are all chatting in the center. So, like, it's not the best idea. So, just go to the sides because they don't have anyone in the sides. So, you can easily attack him. And boom, you can win. <laughs> nah, bro. Boom. Oh, my God. I'm going to defend that shit. Look. Too good. Because I've literally created a defense guide. Guys, if y'all haven't watched it, go check it out. Dang, too good. Reading the opponent like crazy. the size we can go and Beckham will make a run 
And we do this. Howland. Oh, wow, the goalkeeper. The goalkeeper is saving this guy's ass right now, bro. This could have been a 3-0, but Dunarum, I mean, Dunarum is always good. But look at that clean cross. Whoo! Holland is a goat. Oh, I hit his ass! I hit Palmer's ass! My bad, bro. My bad. I didn't want to do you like that. Sorry, bro. Shit, this De Bruyne? He's so fast? That's weird. Okay. Okay. Oh. Holy. And we pass the back end because he's so open. I could see it in the minimap. You want to look at the minimap often and see if someone is open or not. So I can see like Albert Ferrer making a run and I can see that back end is not marked. So I do this. Ooh, whoa, okay. See, looking at this minimap is very effective. So. Sometimes, just not all the time, just take a glance and look who's open and who's not, so you can make right place. Bro, what the hell is he doing, bro? This shit funny. This shit funny, I'm gonna be honest. Bro, he substituted his entire team, bro. Like, I am the one who needs to do this, because he's playing possession game, and if you face possession games, uh, your players will get tired easily, but no, mines are still great. Look at this back end, bro. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do this. Whee. Nah, I couldn't. I couldn't. I couldn't. Pass to back him again. We can come close and we can cross to who? Of course! To Holland. They're so good together. Look at that. Oh, nah, bro is cooked. Bro is cooked. See we? Okay, bro is cooked. Bro is cooked. Bro is cooked. Trust, 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 trust. <laughs> okay. Yeah, this formation is all about cross spamming. If you're a cross spammer, this formation is good. I mean, if you're not a cross spammer, this formation is still good. But wait, wait. Okay, bro, his goalkeeper is carrying so hard. Bro, I swear, when I look at the ratings, bro, his goalkeeper will have the MVP. This was perfect. This is perfect. I should score this. Okay. But yeah, 3-0, just like that. Easy, no problem. Skill diff, Beckham diff, Highland diff, whatever. Yeah, bro, he has three saves. Holy, 11 total shots. All crosses. I feel like it's all crosses. Okay, so let's go to player ratings. Oh, it's Rodri. What about his goalkeeper, though? Wait, what? 4.5 would go. Okay, what about me? Beckham. It's Beckham because he made all the assists and all this stuff. And of course, he's gonna be the MVP. So, yeah, guys, that's how easy it is to play with this formation. If you enjoyed this video and learned something new, don't forget to drop a like and subscribe to my channel. I am, as always, Rivus, and I'll see you in the next video.